What's up guys, it's Neil here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to get emoji suggestions on any Android keyboard you're using. So before we get started, let me just inform you that the application that I'll be using called Dango is still in its beta stages of testing. So until it's officially on the Google Play Store, head into this guide on Gadget Hacks and follow the links in order to officially become a beta tester and potentially see your suggestions in future versions of the application. Once you do become a tester, you'll be provided a Google Play Store link allowing you to install the application called Dango. Upon launching it, you may see this sad face. It's just informing you that you have yet to enable accessibility services. So just go ahead and tap accessibility services. You'll be directed to your settings, the accessibility settings, and just go all the way down under services and you should see Dango, emoji prediction, and just go ahead and toggle on that service. So now when you're all set, open up the application, hit this settings icon, the little cog up there, and you have a few options. You can use system emoji font or you can use noto emoji font. Um, system ones or a little more custom, I guess you can say. Nexus devices have their own, TouchWiz devices have their own, or you can just use the common emoji font. Then there's dark theme, light theme, and you can just reset all your settings. So now whenever you text, you'll get those little suggestions to the size in a bubble and depending on what you're typing it will give you some useful suggestions so as you can see it's really useful and keep in mind you can always move this and expand it if you need to you can also look up emojis but the suggestions is where you're really gonna get most use out of the out of this application also, don't worry about always getting suggestions. It only pops up when you're in a messaging application like your stock messenger, hangouts, or in an email. So don't worry if you're searching the internet or something, it won't come up in a search field just when you're messaging. Remember to check out the full guide over at gadgethacks.com for all the details. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for some more awesome and very useful gadget hack videos. Thanks, guys.